Hi, my name is Stacy. This is Nugget and Cookie, and they're going to help me with the project today. It's almost my ninth anniversary, wedding anniversary, so I decided to make a present for my husband, Ed, thus nine years ago, believe it or not. So I happen to own my own puzzle making company, so I thought, why not make him a puzzle? So inside, I put everything that was in my heart, and then I gave it to him. So you can see all the little kinds of things we have in here. Maybe this would be easier. I don't know how I got all this in here. Things that were important to me, things that were important to him, trips we've taken, all this kind of stuff. So the other day he actually was looking at this. He got this out for some reason, was looking at this. It's been a while. And I thought, wow, wouldn't it be neat if I take all these things and make it into a puzzle? Okay, so here's what I came up with using the map. I'm trying it both ways, vertically and horizontally. You want a little bit of space on the edges for sure. When you take your photos, so you can crop it the way you want it. Okay, we're back. I'm in my office and I have cropped my picture. And let me just show you on my screen. There's my laptop, but on the bigger screen, here it is. Now, what I like to do with my puzzles is create a background. You don't have to do that. We could have done the whole picture as the puzzle, but I know my husband, one, he likes the date on things. So by doing this, I could put the date there. I could also make it, it's like a card. I could put te any text I want onto it. I put a little nine and a heart there because it's our ninth anniversary. And then look what I wrote. You still have my heart, Stacy. Okay, here we go. Here's our printout. It's going to make a great 12 by 12 puzzle. There's a lot going on in it, but I like that with a puzzle. I make it fun and easy to do. Uh, our next step is to glue it onto the chipboard here and then cut it into a puzzle. That will be interesting because Ed, my husband, always helps me with that. So not only am I going to have to do that all by myself, I'm going to have to do that without him knowing I'm doing it. So that'll be interesting. Stay tuned with us. Here's Nugget. Here's Cookie. She's watching for something. And stay tuned with us for next time. We'll show you how we cut it and make it into a puzzle and what it turns out to look like. 